Hello, it's Mr. Woodham, and we're going to do a maths class now on factorising into two brackets. This is lesson two, and we're going to introduce negative numbers, so you need to make sure you've watched lesson one first. We're going to start with an example. So the question says, factorise x squared plus 3x minus 10. So we set the question up with our two sets of brackets, and then we circle the 10 at the end, including the minus. And we're going to list some pairs of numbers that multiply together to make minus 10. So we could have minus 1 and 10, or we could have 1 and minus 10, because both of those pairs multiply together to make minus 10. We could also have minus 2 and 5, or 2 and minus 5. So we look in the middle of the question, and it says plus 3x. So we need to pick one of these pairs of numbers that adds together to make plus 3x. So we're going to pick minus 2 and 5 because minus 2 plus 5 gives plus 3x. So we know that in our brackets goes x minus 2 and x plus 5. So we factorise x squared plus 3x minus 10. Okay, we do another example now. The question says factorise x squared minus 2x minus 15. So again, we can set the question up with our two sets of brackets. And we circle the 15 at the end, including the minus. And we start to list some pairs of numbers that multiply together to make minus 15. So we could have minus 1 and 15, or we could have 1 and minus 15, because both of these pairs times together to make minus 15. We could also have minus 3 and 5, or 3 and minus 5. Now the question says minus 2x. So we need to pick one of these pairs that adds together to make minus 2x. So we're going to pick 3 and minus 5, because 3 plus minus 5 gives us minus 2x. So in our brackets, let's go x plus 3 and x minus 5. So we factorised x squared minus 2x minus 15. Some practice questions are coming up, so pause the tape and have a go at them now. The answers will follow. Good luck. Hope you got them all right. Thanks for watching.